Jack and Jill went up to help both with a buck and a quarter. Stop it. That's the wrong clip. I'm going to get canceled. Shout out to Aqua de Parma Oud. Aqua de Parma Oud is a woody citrus oud. I like it. It relaxes me. Great for the summer. Really not. It's wearable for me in the summer. It calms me down. Aqua de Parma Oud. Woody citrus oud. I know I'm going to get beat up for this, but I truly hate compliments. I'm 57 years old. I've been wearing Stetson since 11 years old, you know, and like I wore Stetson to my bar mitzvah when I was 13. Stetson, you know, it was like one of those gifts your mom would throw in for Hanukkah. Just one day, here, Stetson. Okay, I have like six bottles of Stetson from the 1970s. If you're looking for the most complimented video, right here, Terry Demez, women will automatically respect you. It's almost like they want to call you sir. They're like, sir, you smell so nice. What are you wearing? Terry Demez. It's orangey. It's rudy. It's a dirty orange. It's vetiver. It's respect in a bottle. Respect in a bottle. Remember that. Now, since I've been wearing cologne for 46 years of my life, I can tell you, like one of those girls from the thumbnail will never approach you. It's mostly like the creepy women. And you know, you think to yourself, there's creepy women out there? Like, yeah, there's creepy guys, there's creepy women. When I wear Terre de Mez, they just go gaga. And they come up to me and they're like, oh my God. You, you smell great like um can i have your phone number they're asking me for my phone number but the thing is like the girl i'm looking at if there is that woman there at the time i'm kind of embarrassed because i'm talking to a woman i don't want to be with and she's like she won't leave me alone like i can't escape her because i'll say hey thank you no hey uh can i have your phone number it's like she's the creepy guy she's not She's a little stalking-ish, right? She's stalking you, and it's very weird. As a man, you, you want the beautiful woman. You know, we're very visual creatures. You want, we're not gonna all get the beautiful woman. I'm not gonna get the beautiful woman anymore. Like, I'm 57, I'm rusty. It's, it's not the same as when I was 37 or 27. I wore a fragrance to a faculty meeting when I was a teacher. And this woman was creeping me out. And after the faculty meeting, she says, oh my God. She says, listen, give me your phone number. Forget your girlfriend. We're going to have a good time. Wear that cologne. I'm going to make your dreams come true. And I mean, it was, it was too much. The cologne made her drive her crazy. It, it was weird to me. Then I was in the gym and I had the creepiest experience. This woman was sitting there. We were all drinking protein shakes. And she's like, who's the guy that smells so delicious? I love that smell so much. And she, I said, is that me? And I, it was Happy Land Signature. And she says, what's the name of it? I said, oh, you've never heard of it. It was like at the beginning, at the launch of Happy Land. And she says, I want to eat you up. And she asked for my phone number. And that was another creepy experience. So the thing about compliments is I hate compliments. It's never the beautiful woman that compliments you. Even when you're on a date, they don't compliment you. You know, maybe later on they'll say, hey, yeah, you know, I really like that cologne you were wearing when we first went out. But like actual verbal compliments, it's always by the creepy woman. And it really is a bad experience every time. Thank you very much. I don't like compliments from a creepy woman. Take care.